power in the precious blood of the Lamb. There is victory, victory, wonder walking victory in the blood of the Lamb. There is victory, victory, wonder walking victory in the precious blood of the Lamb. There is power, there is power, power, wonder walking power in the blood of the Lamb. There is power, power, wonder walking power in the precious blood of the Lamb. There is deliverance, deliverance, super mighty deliverance. In the blood of the Lamb, there is deliverance, deliverance, superpower deliverance. In the precious blood of the Lamb, I plead the blood, the blood of Jesus. 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 There is power, power, wonder walking power. In the blood of the Lamb, there is power, power, wonder-working power. In the precious blood of the Lamb, there is miracle, miracle, super mighty miracle. In the blood of the Lamb, there is miracle, miracle. Super mighty miracle in the precious blood of the Lamb. There is healing, healing, wonder walking healing in the blood of the Lamb. There is healing, healing, super mighty healing in the precious blood of the Lamb. I plead the blood, the blood of Jesus. 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 Glory be to God in the highest. I welcome everyone. To the presence of the Almighty God tonight in Jesus' name. Our God is a great God. I'm going to give you heads up before I started uh, concerning the prayer of uh, the other prayer that I said we will touch base with tonight. We are not going to do that because I really want to focus on sprinkling the blood of Jesus Christ because we have a lot of things to do tonight from this. And I know God is going to glorify His name in each of our lives in Jesus' name. I want you to be rest assured in the Lord. That whatever you read in the Bible is what God says. And it is what will come to pass concerning your life. Not what anybody say. Not any may say. It is what God says about you. What God talks about this situation that is going on around the world that really matters. Our God is a great God. We have seen diverse of situations like this in the Bible. And God intervened and everything was okay. Everything went back to normal. God is a great God. Our God is a great God. Um, I'm going to quickly look into the book of Lepticus, chapter 14. I will read from verse 1 to 9 tonight. I want you to know, this talks about leprosy. 
in the land of Egypt. And what God, what did God say to Mo, uh, to Moses to do with it, with the priest in the land? God told them to get the blood of a bird of a lamb, and which they did. They acted unto what God tells them to do. They did according to to what God instructed them to do in the Bible, and everything did what everything went to normal. We don't. We have the blood of Jesus Christ available for us, though you might not be able to see it in the physical. Except God Himself open your eyes to see, and then you'll be able to see and know that the blood of Jesus Christ is real. Glory be to the Almighty God. If you have ever, God has ever opened your eyes before, maybe in a dream, maybe in a trance, maybe in any way that God can open your eyes to see that the blood of Jesus Christ is real and it is pure, you will know that, that this blood is very important and it speaks better things than the blood of the Lamb. Glory be to the Almighty God. In the book of Leviticus chapter 14, verse 1 to 9, God instructed Moses and the priest in the land to do something which they did. They acted to what God says. We continue. We started this last weekend, last Sunday, on the sprinkling of the blood of Jesus Christ as God brought it to my spirit that I should sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ over my entire families, over everything that pertains to me. I should get pictures of my loved ones and begin to sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ over it. And I did. And God says, I want you to tell my children around the world. I want them to do the same thing because the blood of Jesus Christ is going to speak for each and every one of you. This is the blood. Of, he said, God said to me that this is the blood of his only begotten son that he has given to us. He gave him out freely. We read it this morning. I went during the ministration this morning that God, for God so loved the world, the book of John, that he gave his only begotten son, Jesus Christ, that whosoever believe in him will not perish, but have what? Everlasting life. Glory be to the almighty God. Our God is a great God. Our God is awesome. Our God is mighty. Our God is wonderful. We, do, we are not serving a dead God in this ministry. And I have instructed everyone this morning, whenever you want to join this platform, please come with your Bible. Make sure you join with your Bible because there is nothing that is done on, in this ministry that is aside the word of God. Glory be to his name in Jesus' name. Our God is so wonderful. I'm so glad and I'm so blessed in the, in the Lord Jesus Christ. This is not of my doing. This is the doing of the Lord Jesus Christ. God is always good and is always ready to listen to the cry of his children. Whatever is going on around the world now, we know that God is in it. Like I said in the morning, God knows everything. He understands everything that is going on around the world. He knows how it started and he knows how it's going to end it. Ours is to pray. Pray and be obedient. And anyone that has doing something, whatever you drink in secret, that no, you cannot come out in public and be bored of to say it to the public, to the masses. It's better you stop it. It's better you do what you answer from it. It's better you let go and let God take control of your life. It is, this is the time. This is the crucial time in this year. And as some people are prophesying that this is just a tip, I didn't pray for anything evil to happen again in this year and years to come. Because a lot of lives has been wasted with this. My own prayer is that God should put an end to it. That God should please have mercy and put an end to all things that is going on around the world. That God should please have mercy and forgive of our, of our sins. And that is what we all need to plead for, for, for God's mercy. Glory be to the Almighty God. I already briefed what I read in the book of Leviticus, chapter 14 to you, 1 to 9. It's about God instructing Moses and the priest in the land to offer, to, to, to use the blood of an animal to sprinkle it because to, in order for the leprosy to go away. Because the land, the, the God inflicted the land with leprosy in the days of, uh, of Pharaoh. Even though Spirit still adding up his heart, he didn't still yield to God, and a lot of things happen. My prayer is that those that God is doing this because of them, that they will yield, they will yield, they will turn from their evil ways. There is nothing that happens. They say that a leaf cannot drop from a tree without the knowledge of God. There is no way a leaf, even, even if it is a, as tiny as this, if that leaf should drop from that tree, God, God is aware of it. 
So know this, that God is aware of what is going on. He's aware of it. May God help us all in Jesus' name. May the blood of Jesus Christ begin to speak for us. May that blood speak mercy. May the blood of Jesus Christ speak healing, deliverance into over our land and over every members of our families in Jesus' name. God is awesome. God is wonderful. God is marvelous. Glory be to the Almighty God in Jesus' name. And there is something that I will tell you to do. You are going to do it on your own tonight. He says, you can do it tonight, you can do it before you step out of your home in the morning. And what is this? I want you to take your pen and paper and write this down. Psalm 24, Psalm 37, Psalm 91, and Psalm 136. You will, stay, you will do this and get a bowl of water and read this Bible five chapters in it. And you will command that water to turn to the blood of Jesus Christ. You will bathe with it. You bet your family with it. If your family are not with you, sprinkle it over their pictures. Sprinkle it over your own, over your surrounding. Like we did last week. The different thing that we are doing tonight is you are going to bed with it from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet with your entire family. So you can get as much as you can get and just read Psalm 20. Can somebody write this on the platform, please? Psalm 24, Psalm 27. Psalm 91, Psalm 136. Psalm 136 is a, is a, is a, a, a praise worship psalm. You giving thanks to God because of what it is good to give thanks to God. You give thanks to God and you mention your name and the names of your entire family as you read that psalm in the name of Jesus Christ. And I know no evil will befall us in Jesus' mighty name. I'm going to do it. Read it again. Somebody should put it on the platform, please. I'm saying the book of Psalm 24. Psalm 27, Psalm 91, and Psalm 136. We are going to read this in the water tonight or tomorrow morning. Or you can do it tonight, whichever way you want to do it. Just make sure you do it and bear with it. And sprinkle it over your home. Glory be to the Almighty God. The book of Hebrews chapter 12. Hebrews chapter 12, verse 24. The word of the Lord says, And thank you so much, brother Abdul. God bless you so much. God bless you, uh, yeah, Psalm 34, 27, 91, and 136. God bless you, sir. Um, Hebrews 12, 24 says, And to Jesus, the mediator of the new covenant, and to the blood of sprinkling, that speaketh better things than the blood of Abel. The blood of Jesus Christ speaks better things than the blood of Abel, than the blood of bull, than the blood of rat, than the blood of bulls, or whatsoever it is. Because we are using the blood of Jesus Christ. We are not using the blood of anything other than the blood of Jesus Christ. And as we go, even if it's 10 minutes, 5 minutes that we are, that we are spending on this platform tonight, I want you to set your mind on the cross. And you will know that God is good. Let us begin to appreciate God first of all. Begin to say, Lord, I thank you for the availability of your blood. Thank you for the privilege to know you as my Lord. Thank you for that grace that you have given to me to accept you as my Lord and my Savior. Begin to appreciate God tonight. Begin to give him glory. Give him honor. Give him adoration. Exalt the name of the Almighty God. Worship him with, with, with his goodness in your life. Appreciate God for his faithfulness to you and your family. Thank God for providing his only begotten son, Jesus Christ, and for the offering of his blood. For us to be able to use today, begin to thank Him because without the, the, without the blood of Jesus Christ, I don't know what will have happened because the blood of Jesus Christ is so powerful and it works. It works miracle. It works wonder. Begin to pray right now, Heavenly Father. We thank you tonight. We bless your holy name. We appreciate you for giving us access to the throne of mercy, Lord. We thank you for access to your blood, Lord Jesus Christ. You have given you have given us access at all time to your precious blood. Daddy, we thank you. Daddy, we worship you. Jehovah, we honor you. Jehovah, we exalt your name. We bless your name. We appreciate you so much, Daddy, because you are great and you are awesome. You are wonderful, Lord Jesus Christ. Daddy, be that exalted and be that glorified. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Holy Spirit. We worship you. We honor you. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I want you to begin to plead that blood. The blood of Jesus Christ. Begin to plead the blood of Jesus Christ over your spirit, soul, and body. 
over your family in the name of Jesus Christ. Heavenly Father, tonight I plead the blood of Jesus Christ over my son, over my daughter, Lord. I cover their environment, their facility in the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak everything that has to, uh, con that concerns them, oh Lord, in the blood of Jesus Christ, in Jesus' name. I plead the blood of Jesus over myself tonight, oh Lord. I soak myself and all that concerns me in the blood of Jesus Christ. I cover my spirit, soul, and body in the blood of Jesus. I cover my spirit, man, in the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak everyone on this platform tonight in the blood of Jesus Christ. Father, Father, Lord, flood this platform, O Lord, with your blood tonight in Jesus' name. Father, make your blood available and sufficient for us, O Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, as we enter into the throne of mercy tonight, O Lord, as we enter into Golgotha tonight, Lord, to use your blood, O Lord, let this blood be available for us, O Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, O Lord. Father, we sprinkle your blood over us every side of our lives, O Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. We plead the blood of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ. We plead the blood of, of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus' name. Amen. Glory be to God in the highest in Jesus' name. Our God is good. Our God is great. Our God is awesome. We have seven virtues in the blood of Jesus Christ. There are seven virtues in the blood of Jesus Christ. Let's quickly open our Bible to the book of Revelation. Revelation chapter 5, verse 12. So then you will see the seven virtues that are in the blood of Jesus Christ. As, and we are going to apply those seven virtues into your life tonight. Glory be to the Almighty God. Our God is great. Oh, Mama. Saint The book of Revelation chapter 5. Chapter 5, verse 12, please. Chapter 5, verse 12, please. Mm -hmm. Glory be to God. Say, say with a loud voice, worthy is the Lamb that was slain to receive power, riches, wisdom, strength, and honor, and glory, and blessing. To receive power, one, riches, two, wisdom, three, strength, four, honor, five, glory, six, and blessing. Those are the, that is the seventh one. So those are the seven features in the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. And I pray that as we pray tonight, all these are going to come upon each and every one of us in Jesus' name. It will come upon us, come upon, upon our homes, our families, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We have the blessings of the Almighty God. We will receive power. We will receive riches, wisdom, strength, and honor and glory and blessing through the blood of Jesus Christ in the mighty name of Jesus. Our God is great. Our God is awesome. Our God is mighty. Tonight, I want you to go into the presence of God and say, God, I have come to Golgotha tonight. See yourself in Golgotha now, by the cross of the Lord Jesus Christ. See yourself under that cross. Thank you, Jesus. And begin to see the blood of Jesus Christ pouring over you from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet. Begin to see the blood of Jesus Christ pouring over your children. From the crown of their head to the sole of their feet. Begin to see the blood of Jesus Christ over your own, over your husband, your wife, over all that concerns you, over your entire families. Begin to see that blood as it starts to drop over you and soaking you from, your, from the crown of your head to your toe. Begin to appreciate God. Because I see the blood of Jesus Christ over each and every one of us tonight. I see everyone in Golgotha now by the cross of the Lord Jesus Christ. And I see that blood that is flowing from the Lord Jesus Christ. And it's flowing over each and every one of us. I see the blood of Jesus Christ saturating us from the crown of our head to the sole of our feet. I see the blood of Jesus Christ pouring on us tonight, soaking us and delivering us from every form of evil. I see the blood of Jesus Christ standing as a shade for each and every one tonight and our entire family. I see the blood of Jesus Christ breaking every satanic power, every evil arrow, every satanic deposit in our body, in our system. I see the blood of Jesus Christ breaking and destroying them tonight. Oh, Mama, Saint Kerry, Makuri, I see the blood of Jesus Christ speaking deliverance, victory into everyone's body tonight. Oh, yes, Lord. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your holy name. I see the blood of Jesus Christ falling over you and to set you free totally. Total deliverance. Total victory is your portion through the blood of Jesus Christ. Oh, Mama, thank you, Mama. You need to open up your hearts tonight and see yourself in Gogo, in Gogota 
under the cross of the Lord Jesus Christ and begin to focus on that cross and begin to appreciate God as he's pouring his blood over you. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Father, we thank you tonight. We bless your name. Thank you, Jehovah. Blessed be your name, O Lord. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you for your blood that is flowing over us now. Thank you for cleansing us by your blood. Thank you for redeeming us by your blood. Thank you for flushing out of our system through your blood everything that the devil has deposited. Every satanic deposited in our lives. Thank you because your blood is cleansing us tonight. Father, we thank you. We worship you. <coughs> thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Glory be to God. I want you to pray. As I sat here a couple of minutes ago, I just began to wonder, to, to, excuse me, to ponder on the blood of Jesus Christ. And with all that I've read concerning this precious blood in the Bible, I begin to focus on the cross. And I say this week, this is another week. What is today's date? Today is 29th of March. This is a new week that we are all going to. And I was in my heart, in my spirit. I begin to soak this week in the blood of Jesus Christ. Every day, every second, minutes, hours. In this week, as we step out. I begin to pour the blood of Jesus Christ on every day of this week as we set out. Because everybody, we are like a blind person when you go out, especially during this time. Nobody knows what is going to happen, but we have faith in the Lord that no evil will befall us. No disease will come near us. No plague will come near us. That is our belief in the Lord Jesus Christ. That we are not going to contact it with anything evil as we set out of our own. Because there is no way, no matter how they tell you to, to stay home, there's going to be a day that you will go out. There's going to be one day out of that week that you will step out. So I begin to say, Lord, if I thought this time is a very special time for every one of your children all over the world, your blood has been made available to us to use at all times. You have given us grace to your blood, access to your blood, to use it as many times as we want to use it. You can lay in your bed at times, and God will open your eyes to see something. Even if you are not able to pray that time, you're, you're mentioning the blood of Jesus Christ has, has finished everything for you. If it is only the blood of Jesus Christ, you can say. Even when you find yourself in anything that is not, that is not to, the, to the glory of God in your dream, as soon as you measure that blood, the blood of Jesus Christ, everything, every, all those things, evil power has been up. They have been destroyed. It has been nullified. The blood of Jesus Christ has nullified it. So what did I do? Which I want all of us to do is this. I say, Lord, as I go in this week, as my family step out in this way, I don't know the day. I don't know the hour. But you know that we have to go out one day or two or three in this week. Is anything that the devil has planted out there against any of us? Lord, today I owe your blood. You, owe, you do your fist like this. I owe your blood tight in my hand by faith against it. And I decree that this precious blood of Jesus Christ should go today into this week, the week of 29th of March. This is another week. We start another week today. Let your blood go out there and destroy every evil in this week for me and my family. Destroy them. Total de destruction, Lord. Let your blood begin to go right now. Begin to pray that the blood of Jesus Christ should go ahead of you into this week and destroy anything evil that is out there waiting for you and your family member. Anything that is out there that is waiting for you and your children that is not of God. Begin to command the blood of Jesus Christ to go ahead of you into this week and destroy them. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Heavenly Father, I pray tonight, Lord Jesus Christ, O oh Lord, as I commit this week of 29th of March into your hands, O oh Lord. This is a new, a new entire week, O oh Lord. 
Father, is there anything that has been set, O oh Lord, by the devil against any member of my family in this week? Lord, I send forth your blood, your blood tonight, O oh Lord. Let your blood go ahead of us in this week, O oh Lord, and destroy every satanic works in Jesus' name. Anything that has been breathed in the air, the one that has been breathed on the land, on the sea, in any way, in any form, Father, let your blood go ahead of us and destroy them in Jesus' name. Lord, I sprinkle your blood over this week and everything that comes with it, O oh Lord. I hold the blood of Jesus Christ firm in my hands tonight, O oh Lord, against every form of evil, Lord, that has been spitted or breathed, O oh Lord, into this week against me, against any member of my family. Father, destroy it tonight in Jesus' name. I soak my son, soak my daughter in the blood of Jesus Christ. I immerse them in the ocean of the blood of Jesus Christ. I sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ over them from the crown of their head to the soles of their feet, O oh Lord. I cover their food this week that everything that will be entered into entering into their stomach oh lord i soak everything in the blood of jesus christ i soak their clothes their bed in the blood of jesus christ i cover everything that concerns my son and my daughter in the blood of jesus christ lord by your blood destroy every satanic works against any member of this ministry oh lord destroy them by your fire by your blood in jesus name let the blood of jesus christ begin to avail for us oh lord let your blood speak for us oh lord let the blood of jesus christ fight our battles for us oh lord let your blood of, the blood of Jesus Christ destroy every form of evil law that is going on around the world, O Lord. Father, we sprinkle your blood over our homes tonight in the name of Jesus. We sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ, O Lord, over every member of our family, O Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ, begin to sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ over your home, over all that concerns you. Sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ, get the pictures of your children, begin to sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ over it now. In the name of Jesus, Lord, I sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ, O Lord, over my entire home, O Lord, over my children, over their place, O Lord. I sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ tonight, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, let your blood begin to speak for us, O Lord. Let let your blood begin to wash us, O Lord, cleanse us, O Lord. Deliver us from every form of evil in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, O Lord. Father, your word says we overcome by the blood of the Lamb and the word of your testimony, O Lord. And we do not love our life unto death, O Lord. Father, Lord Jesus Christ, overcome every evil by your blood, O Lord. Overcome every satanic evil, O Lord, by your blood. Every evil fire us, O Lord. Father, destroy them by your blood, O Lord. Give us victory over them by your blood, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, give us deliverance over every form of evil fire us, O Lord. By your blood, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, put a stop to this corona fire us, O Lord, by your blood, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, save us by your blood. Deliver us by your blood. Protect us by your blood in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, O oh Lord. Let your blood begin to speak for us, O oh Lord, every day, every second, every minute, every hour, O oh Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, let your word, the blood, O oh Lord, the blood of Jesus Christ destroy every satanic works, O oh Lord. In the name of Jesus, O Mama Senkerema Kurisi Boborobo Senkerema. O Mama Senkerema Kurisi Bobo. O Robobo Senkerema Kurisi Boborobo Senkerema. The blood of Jesus, the blood of Jesus, the blood of Jesus. Father, we plead your blood tonight, O Lord, against every evil, O Lord, that is going on around the world, O Lord. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ against it tonight in Jesus' name. Father, flush out this evil out of the earth, O Lord, by your blood, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, let your blood flood it out, O Lord. Let it flood it out of the earth, O Lord. Every satanic virus that is going on around the world, I command the blood of Jesus Christ to flood it out of this world, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Father, protect us, O Lord. Protect our homes, O Lord. Protect all that concerns us, O Lord. Save and deliver us from all this evil, Lord Jesus Christ, in Jesus' name. Deliver us, deliver our family members, deliver our loved ones, O oh Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, the blood of Jesus, the blood of Jesus. Emama Senkeri Makurisi Boboro Bobo Senkeri Ma. Oro Bobo Senkeri Makurisi Boboro Bobo Senkeri Ma. I plead the blood of Jesus Christ tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Glory be to God. In the mighty name of Jesus. Our God is a great God. Like I said earlier on, we're not going to take much time tonight. I just want to know, want you to know that Jesus Christ is in this with each and every one of us. Know tonight that Jesus Christ is in this with us. The, and know that you are saved by, by the blood of Jesus Christ. You are saved and you are protected by the precious blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. It's faith. We are, we've talked about faith this morning. Faith in time, in challenging period. Once you have faith in the Lord, it is your faith that will give you boldness, though it is strong of mercy. 
It is your faith that will take you to Golgotha, where the cross of the Lord Jesus Christ is. And you'll be able to, to begin to plead that blood by faith over yourself and your family. And as you close your eyes, you set your mind on the things of heaven. And you see yourself under that cross. You see the cross of Jesus Christ pouring the blood of Jesus Christ over you. Then you will feel with the, with, you will have that assurance in the Lord that nothing of evil will happen to you and your family member. Even if your family are not with you, you will have that assurance because the, Bible, the word of God says in, it, in his word that the prayer of the righteous availeth much. The prayer of the righteous availeth much. All what we needed in this time is faith and to be strong and to be courageous. Do not let your faith in the Lord will not fail you. My faith in the Lord Jesus Christ will not fail me. I said this, Psalm 24, 27, 91, and 136. I want every one of us to get a bowl of water tonight and read it and command that water to turn to the blood of Jesus Christ. By faith, as you wash your body in it, you, it is strong faith that you needed. That is the blood of Jesus Christ that you are pouring over yourself. And it will work for us. It will work for every one of us in the name of Jesus Christ. That blood will never fail us. The blood of Jesus Christ will never fail any of us because it is what God has promised, promised us of. And it will work for us in Jesus' name. I want you to begin to sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ again. You can walk around your home again tonight. We are not going to stop until God clear this thing out. Every Sunday now, only if I'm, I'm not home, and even if I'm not home, once I step in, the time is what is going to change. We have to do it every Sunday now, the sprinkling of the blood of Jesus Christ. We have to keep continuing to sprinkle that blood over our entire home, over our environment. You sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ every day, every time. Soon as you get up from your bed, Lord, today I sprinkle your blood over my entire home. By faith, I dip my hand in the blood of Jesus Christ and I sprinkle it over my entire home, over all that concerns me. Let your blood begin to destroy every form of evil, Lord Jesus, as I go in this day and sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ over this day, over this week, over every seconds, minutes, hours, oh Lord, every day in this week, oh Lord, I sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ over you. I owe the blood of Jesus Christ against anything that the devil might have breathed, oh Lord, whether in the air, on the land, and on the sea, Lord, against me, against my family member, I hold the blood of Jesus Christ against you. Let your faith in the Lord be strong. And I know God is going to see us through in this season in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We are not going to fall proof of this evil virus in the mighty name of Jesus. God will save us and he will protect us. I want you to pray and say, Lord Jesus, by your blood tonight, O oh Lord, destroy every satanic works against me and my family. In the name of Jesus Christ, begin to pray. Every father tonight, by your blood, Lord Jesus Christ, destroy every satanic works, O oh Lord, against me, against my children, O oh Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Father, by your blood tonight, destroy every works of the enemy, O oh Lord, against me, my children, O oh Lord. In the name of Jesus, I command the blood of Jesus Christ to destroy every satanic works, O oh Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, every evil works, O oh Lord, against me, against my children, I command you to be destroyed tonight by the blood of Jesus. I command you to be destroyed tonight by the fire of Holy Ghost. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, destroy, O oh Lord, every satanic works, O oh Lord, against me, against my son, against my daughter, Lord, I command your destruction tonight by the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus' name. Amen. I want you to pray and say, Father, wherever my feet cannot get to, starting from tonight, let your blood begin to speak for me. Begin to pray that anywhere your feet cannot get to, that the blood of Jesus Christ should go tonight and speak on your behalf. In the name of Jesus, every, every Father, I pray tonight, oh Lord, anywhere, any place that my feet cannot get to, I command the blood of Jesus Christ to go tonight and speak for me in Jesus' name, wherever the feet of my son and my daughter cannot get to, Lord. Father, let your blood begin to speak for them, oh Lord. Let the blood of Jesus Christ speak on behalf of my son and my daughter, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, every Father, 
Father, let your blood begin to speak for me, speak for my children, O Lord, wherever our feet cannot get to, Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ, anywhere the feet of every one of your children in this on this platform tonight, O Lord, cannot get to, Lord. Father, let your blood begin to speak for them, O Lord, in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. I want you to pray and say, Father, Lord Jesus Christ, by your blood, O Lord, deliver me from every satanic court, O Lord. Begin to pray that God should deliver you by his blood from every satanic court that they have taken your name and your picture to in the name of Jesus Christ Father tonight by your blood O Lord deliver me deliver my children O Lord from every satanic court O Lord every court that they have taken our names to Lord that they have taken our pictures to Lord Father deliver us in Jesus name from every satanic court in Jesus name let the blood of Jesus Christ deliver me deliver my children O Lord in the mighty name of Jesus Christ O precious blood of Jesus Christ deliver me deliver my children O Lord from every satanic court in the name of Jesus Christ O Lord every court that have settled Lord Every judgment against me, against my children, O Lord, I pray that the blood of Jesus Christ will deliver us tonight in Jesus' name. I command the blood of Jesus Christ to deliver me, to deliver my son and my daughter, O Lord, from every satanic court in Jesus' name. O blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus Christ, begin to deliver every one of your children, O Lord, from satanic court in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I pray tonight that wherever our names and pictures have been taken to, in any satanic court, I pray that the blood of Jesus Christ will set us free tonight. I pray that the blood of Jesus Christ will lose us in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I want you to pray and say, Oh, blood of Jesus Christ, as I go in this week, direct my path. Blood of Jesus Christ can do so many things. Pray that the blood of Jesus Christ should direct your path and the path of your children as you step out of your home in this week. In the name of Jesus Christ, O oh, blood of Jesus Christ, I pray, O Lord, as I step out in this week, O oh, Lord, Father, by your blood, direct my path in Jesus' name. O oh, blood of Jesus Christ, direct my sons and my daughters' path, O oh, Lord, in everything that they do this week, O oh, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, O oh, Lord. Father, Lord Jesus Christ, O oh, Lord, by your blood, O oh, Lord, depart, the, oh, Lord, direct the path of my son, O oh, Lord, direct my daughter's path, O oh, Lord, by your blood in Jesus' name. Father, direct my path in this week, O oh, Lord, by your blood, O oh, Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ. <coughs> Direct the part of every one of your children, O Lord, in this week by your blood in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I want you to pray and say, O oh, blood of Jesus Christ, be my defense, O Lord, as I go in this week. Begin to pray that the blood of Jesus Christ should be your defense as you go in this week. In the name of Jesus, O oh, blood of Jesus Christ, be my defense, be the defense of my son and my daughter, Lord, as we go in this week in Jesus' name. Blood of Jesus Christ, be our defense, O oh, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Father, let your blood be my defense, O oh, Lord. Let it be my sons and my daughter defense, O oh, Lord, as we go in this week in Jesus' name. O oh, blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus Christ, O oh, Lord, be our defense, O oh, Lord, as we go in this week in Jesus' name. Amen. Glory be to the Almighty God. I want you to pray and say, Blood of Jesus Christ, enter into every satanic kingdom tonight. Every kingdom that has been erected against me and my family, I command the blood of Jesus Christ to enter into them tonight and destroy them totally. In the name of Jesus Christ, begin to pray. Every Father, I command your blood tonight, O oh Lord. Oh Jesus Christ, I command your blood tonight, O oh Lord, to enter into every satanic kingdom, O oh Lord. Every evil kingdom, O oh Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ, O oh Lord. Where my name and the names of my children is being mentioned, O oh Lord. Every evil kingdom that has been erected against me, against my children, O oh Lord. O oh blood of Jesus Christ, enter tonight and destroy them. Destroy them in the name of Jesus Christ. I command the blood of Jesus Christ to enter into that kingdom tonight and destroy them, O Lord. Every evil kingdom, O Lord, that has been erected, that has been lifted, O Lord, against me and my children, Lord. I command the blood of Jesus Christ to enter tonight and destroy them in Jesus' name. O blood of Jesus Christ, enter now. Destroy them, destroy them, O Lord. Destroy them in the name of Jesus Christ. Blood of Jesus Christ, destroy that kingdom tonight. Break it down, O Lord. Pull it down tonight, O Lord. Tear them, O Lord, into pieces, O Lord, by your blood in Jesus' name. Amen. The Bible says the blood of Jesus Christ speaks better thing than the blood of Abel. Not only the blood of Abel, the blood of bull, the blood of cat, the blood of whatever. The blood of Jesus Christ speaks better thing than them all. I want you to pray and say blood of Jesus Christ. As the Bible says in the book of Hebrews 12, 24, that you speak better things than the blood of Abel. Begin to speak better things into my life. In the name of Jesus Christ, O blood of Jesus Christ, the Bible says, your word says, O Lord, that in the book of Hebrews 20, 12, 24, Lord, that the blood of Jesus Christ speaks better things than the blood of Abel, O Lord. Father, let your blood begin to speak better things into my life, O Lord. Let the blood of Jesus Christ speak better things into my son's life, O Lord. I command the blood of Jesus Christ to speak better things into my daughter's life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, 
Oh, blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus Christ, begin to speak better things into my life and into my children's life in Jesus' name. I command the blood of Jesus Christ to speak better things, oh Lord, into my life, in the name of Jesus Christ, into my home, oh Lord, into everything that concerns me, into my job, into my business, oh Lord, into this ministry, oh Lord. I command the blood of Jesus Christ to begin to speak better things in Jesus' name. I command the blood of Jesus Christ to speak better things, oh Lord, over my head, over my children's head, oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, oh Lord, physically, spiritually, oh Lord, blood of Jesus Christ, begin to speak better things into everyone's life, oh Lord, into my life, into my children's life, oh Lord, into the lives of every one of your children, oh Lord. Oh, blood of Jesus Christ, begin to speak better things now in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen in Jesus' name. Glory be to the Almighty God in Jesus' name. I want you to pray for the seven fellowships of the blood that the blood of Jesus Christ owed. The book of Revelation 5, 12. It talks about power. It talks about honor, about glory, about blessing. It talks about wisdom, wisdom, power, wisdom, glory, blessing. What again? Hey, Rachel. <laughs> I, will, I have to mention everything. Glory be to God. Our God is great. All right. Because I don't want us to miss out of any of it. They are all for us. Okay. It talks about power, riches, wisdom, strength, honor, glory, and blessing. I want you to pray and say, Oh, blood of Jesus Christ. The Bible says in the book of uh, Revelation 5 12, saying with a loud voice, Worthy is the Lamb that was slain to receive power, riches, and wisdom, and strength, and honor, and glory, and blessing. I want you to pray and say, Father, tonight by the blood of Jesus Christ, I speak all the seven fellowships that the blood of Jesus Christ is, has received. Every seven fellowships that the blood of Jesus Christ is holding, which is power. I speak power. You begin to pray and speak. I say, through the blood of Jesus Christ, I speak power into my life. Through the blood of Jesus Christ, I speak riches into my life. Through the blood of Jesus Christ, I speak wisdom into my life. Through the blood of Jesus Christ, I speak strength, honor, glory, and blessing into my life tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ, I begin to pray. Every Father tonight, O oh Lord, the word says, O oh Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ, worthy is the Lamb, O oh Lord, that was slain to receive power, Lord. Therefore, tonight, Jehovah, I stand on the altar of your word tonight in the book of, in the book of Revelation 5, 12, O oh Lord. I speak, O oh Lord, power into my son's life. I speak, O oh Lord, power into my daughter's life through the blood of Jesus Christ. I speak riches into my daughter's and my son's life through the blood of Jesus Christ. I speak wisdom into my daughter's and my son's life through the blood of Jesus Christ. I speak strength into my sons and my daughter's life through the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus' name. I speak honor into my sons and my daughter's life tonight through the blood of Jesus. I speak glory into my sons and my daughter's life tonight through the blood of Jesus. I speak blessing into my sons and my daughter's life tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Oh mama senkere makuri si bobo robobo senkere ma. Oh mama senkere makuri si bobo. Father let you this word of your Lord let it become life in my sons and my daughter's life oh Lord. Let this word of yours, O Lord, in the book of Revelation 5, 12, O Lord, let it become life in my daughter's life, life in my son's life, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Father, through your blood, O Lord, tonight I receive power, I receive riches, I receive wisdom, I receive strength, I receive honor, glory, and blessings through the blood of Jesus Christ tonight, and I command this word to become life in me now. In the name of Jesus, O Mama, Senkere Makuri Sibobo, O Robobo, Senkere Makuri Sibobo, Robobo, Senkere Ma, E Mama, Senkere Makuri Sibobo, Oh, Robo Bo Senkere Makuri Sibobo, Robo Bo Senkere Ma. Elele Senkere Makuri Sibobo. Oh, Robo Bo Senkere Ma. Oh, Mama Senkere Makuri. Oh, Robo Bo Senkere Makuri Sibobo, Robo Bo Senkere Ma. Elele Senkere Makuri Sibobo. Thank you, Father. Thank you because this is done in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Glory be to God in Jesus' name. Our God is a great God. Our God is a great God. We have the lamp of God. The lamp of the Lord Jesus Christ. Our God is a great God. I want you to pray and say, Oh, lamp of God, begin your work in my life tonight. Begin to command the lamp of God. Jesus Christ is the lamp of God. 
Command him to begin his work in your life tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, O Lamp of God, I command you tonight to begin your work in my life, begin your work in my sons and my daughter's life. In Jesus' name, O Lamp of the Almighty God, I command you to begin your work, O Lord, both in my life and in my children's life tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Father, let your Lamp begin your his work, O Lord, in our life tonight, O Lord, O Lamp of the Almighty God, begin your work, O Lord, in all your children's life tonight. In Jesus' name, O Mama Senke Riba Kurisi. I command the life of the lamp of God to begin his work in our lives in Jesus' mighty, mighty name. We are praying, Amen. Amen. In Jesus' name, glory be to the Almighty God. In the mighty name of Jesus, I want you to pray and say, Father, by your blood, Lord Jesus Christ, enter into every place tonight where my blessings are this week and bring my blessings to for me. Begin to pray that the blood of Jesus Christ will enter into every places where your blessings are in this week and begin to bring out your blessings unto you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Father, by your blood, Lord Jesus Christ, enter into every place, O Lord, where my blessings are, O Lord, in this week, O Lord, begin to dig out my blessings for me, in Jesus' name, begin to bring my blessings unto me, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, every place, O Lord, where my blessings are, I command the blood of Jesus Christ to go ahead of me tonight, O Lord, and begin to bring my blessings for me, in Jesus' name, Father, bring my blessings for me, O Lord, in every place, O Lord, where my blessings are, O Lord, Lord Jesus Christ, I send you on an errand today to go this week and begin to bring my, 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 my blessings for me, O Lord. I send the blood of Jesus Christ on an errand on behalf of my son and my daughter where their blessings are this week. Go now and bring their blessings to them in Jesus' name. Go now and bring their blessings for them in Jesus' name. In the mighty name of Jesus. O Mama, Father, where my blessings are in this week, O Lord, I send for the blood of Jesus Christ to go ahead of me and bring all my blessings unto me. In Jesus' mighty, mighty name, we are praying. Amen. I want you to begin to command the blood of Jesus Christ to destroy every satanic works, every works of the devil against your life. Whatever the devil has projected out against you for this week, command the blood of Jesus Christ to go ahead of you and destroy them. In the name of Jesus Christ, O blood of Jesus Christ, I command you tonight, O Lord, go into this week and destroy every satanic works, O Lord, anything that the devil has projected, O Lord, into this week against me, against my sons and my daughter, I command the blood of Jesus Christ to go ahead of us and destroy them in Jesus' name. Blood of Jesus Christ, destroy them, destroy them, O Lord. Destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, destroy, O Lord, every satanic projection, O Lord, against me and my children for this week, O Lord. Father, destroy them in Jesus' name. Oh, blood of Jesus Christ, destroy them. Destroy them, O Lord. Blood of Jesus Christ, destroy, O Lord, every satanic projection, O Lord, against me, against my son and my daughter for this week, O Lord. Let them be destroyed. Let them be destroyed. Let them be destroyed. Father, destroy them in Jesus' name. Father, destroy them in Jesus' name. Father, destroy them, O Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. Glory be to the Almighty God in Jesus' name. Our God is a great God. Our God is a great God. God is at work. God is at work. I don't have a doubt as to what God can do. I don't. Because I know I'm not serving a dead God. So you are you are not we are not serving a dead God in this ministry. So I don't doubt God at any time. Because sometimes I'm thinking of something, I want this thing this way, and God is taking it far above the way I was even wanting it. Yes. God is taking it far above the way that I was having it in my mind. So why will I now doubt that God? You can you see? You are waiting for something little, and God said, no. I want something bigger than what you are aiming at for you. Glory be to God. Once again, we are going to round up soon, but we still need to pray. I have to say this once again. Do not medicate yourself. And don't, whatever you drink, don't overdo it. And uh, there's something that I posted in the morning as regard the mask, the N95. And I, they call it, in medical, they call it N95. Those things that you use to cover your nose. Even they say most of it don't really work. But there is certain one, the particular one 
with like glass, glass in its front. Those are the ones that works best. But it's very expensive. You can only get it when, if you work in egg feed. That is the only way you can get it free. But outside is free, uh, it's scarce and it's expensive. But there are ones, the one, I'm not in Africa, you know. And there are ones that they say they send from China. That they are using it to help African countries. Please, those ones, as to what I received this morning, let me tell you the truth. I send you what I received. I'm not confirming it. I don't know how far it is true. But somebody posted it to me. I will not say it's true or it's not true and keep it where it, or it was being sent to. I post it out because sometimes you think something is not real and it's real. You think it's not true and it's true. So at this time, we need to be each other's keeper. Whatever I see, and I know you might not have access to, based on the uh, technology that is not that much available back there in Africa. Though there is, but the, because of this Nepa Nepa and this whatever, the way it's been set up over there, whatever I, am, I, I have privilege to, I have to send it over to the platform for every one of you to, um, to make use of it on time. Glory be to the Almighty God. So you see that guy with the mouth that was popped off. They say it was from the mask that he, was, he used. Who knows what happened? Maybe, and <laughs> I don't know, maybe I, I was telling my, my co-worker or I said it on the platform. La, one of the week, two weeks, last week, when I was coming from my job, I was going to the parking lot. I have this sanitized, uh, what is it called? Wipe in my hand. I always hold it in my hand when I'm stepping out with glove in my hand. So when I get to my car, I wanted to open my car. Then I say, oh, I need to clean. I need to clean the door. So I was cleaning the door. And one guy was standing far. And he was looking at me like he was doing this, like, why are you doing that? I smile. I didn't say anything because I don't, I don't have to bother. But somebody, a friend of mine, a sister, she posted it on her page. I was reading it before I come online tonight. I don't know if I can see it so you can see. Somebody was going around, putting his, mouth in, his hand in his mouth. Maybe he has been contacted, nobody knows. And he was going around to rub it on the car door. So please, you need to take notes and be very careful and have something handy in your hand before if you park your car outside, if you don't park your car in the garage and your home, you don't know what went wrong during the night when you and your family are sleeping. So you don't know who has walked through your lawn and has rubbed something on your car. Please get the wipe, the sanitized wipe, and make sure you clean your door, all the four doors. If you can clean your windscreen, clean it very well before you open it. Because people are so devilish. They are very, very devilish. I don't know why somebody will have that stupidity, the stupidity in their brain and do that. And, and put that. I want to, I want to, okay. I want to see if I can still see it on the sister's page. Because she posted it. Yes. Let it come on. When it's come on, I will, I will show it to you. Please be very, very careful. Just bring it to your attention, guys. Um, there's people walking around in the middle. Oh, did I press something? Oh, he's posting, posting again. Uh, all the people's roadways and the same? door handles of cars. As you can see, that guy there just went into the neighbor's driveway. And now you can see him. You see the guy? Towards my driver, touching his mouth. He was going on around the neighborhood. And this guy, I think he, there is a camera that he mounted outside of his home. And he was looking from his from the inside of his house. His car was parked outside. Was parked on his by, by uh, on the snow on the on the uh, by the what do they call the driveway. He parked his car on the driveway. And this guy was going on this on in the neighborhood. 
putting his his, uh, his his hand, excuse me, he was putting his hand in his mouth and was rubbing it over all the car doors. He will go round and rub, put his hand in his mouth and rub it all over the door. So be very careful. Be very very careful because you never know. You never know. Oh, you saw the video, Sister Fatima. God bless you. Yeah. You never know. Just be very careful. And always be hand ready whenever you are going out to clean your car. You never you don't know. People are so devilish. There are agents of devil out there. We are praying that God should cure the land, that God should help us to drive this thing off. And some people still want to add to it. Huh? Nobody is praying for their own family member alone. We pray for everybody around the world that this thing needs to go. So let us be very careful. Let us be, if I have access, if I'm able to, well, sometimes I'm not able to post some video, but if I'm able to do this, I will still send it. If not, I've already shown it to you. Then you have already heard about it now, just for you to, to have caution and be very careful. Even if you go to work, if you happen to go to work and you step out to your parking lot, make sure you clean your, get the, every place is now, every job now, I believe they have a wipe. And if they don't have, get one from your home before you go. Put it in a, uh, like a snack bag and put it in your bag. So when you are ready to leave in the evening or anytime you close from work, you have it handy so you can clean all your four doors. Prevention is better than cure. Please, may God protect us. As we pray, let us be very careful and be very watchful. We are here to pray for each other. We are here to protect each other. We are here to look after each other. Please, we are one in the Lord Jesus Christ. God has connected us together. So we have, um, um, whatever I can do at my own best, on my own side, I will do it. And I know God Almighty know how to prevent each and every one of us and will prevent us. In Jesus' name, I pray that the blood of Jesus Christ will prevent us. The blood of Jesus Christ will deliver us from every form of evil in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I want you to pray tonight again and say, Father, I come to your presence tonight. Lord, by your blood, have mercy over me and my family. Do not allow all these satanic agents of darkness going around to spread this evil. Do not give us them access to what belongs to me. All my family belongs to me, Lord. Do not give these evil people access to where my family are and to where I am. Begin to pray this prayer and pray it very seriously. There are people going around to spread this thing. I want you to pray and say, Father, I have come to your throne tonight. I have come to your presence tonight. I am right here now, God, by faith in Golgotha, under your cross, Lord. By your blood, Lord Jesus Christ, I bring my entire family to Golgotha tonight under your cross. Father, rain your blood over us. Do not allow all these satanic agents of darkness going around to spread this virus. Do not give them access to my home. Do not give them access to my family. Do not give them access to all that concerns me. Keep us and protect us by your blood. Draw the circle of your blood around every one of us, Lord. Draw the circle of your blood around our homes, around our families, around our belongings, O Lord. Draw the circle of your blood, O Lord, around us when we sleep, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, when we are walking on the streets, O Lord. Father, draw the circle of your blood around us, O Lord. Let there be the demarcation, Lord, by your blood, O Lord, from us and every satanic evil, Lord, that is going around the world, O Lord. Let your blood stand as a demarcation between us, O Lord, and this coronavirus, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, O Lord. Father, shield us away from this evil, Lord. Shield us away from this agent of darkness, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, O Mama, Senke, Rema, Kuri, Sibobo. Father, protect us, protect our homes, O Lord. Protect us, protect all that concerns us, O Lord. In Jesus' mighty, mighty name, we are praying. Amen. I pray that God will protect us from all these satanic agents of darkness that are going on around the world to spread this evil. May God draw the circle of his blood around us. 
May the Almighty God use His precious blood, the blood of Jesus Christ, as a demarcation between us and all these satanic survivors. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray God's protection through the blood of Jesus over every one of us and our family member in Jesus' name. I pray the blood of Jesus Christ as a protection over our homes, over all that concerns us. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, by the sprinkling of the blood of Jesus Christ, we are saved from every form of evil in Jesus' name. We are delivered by the sprinkling of the blood of Jesus Christ. We are protected by the sprinkling of the blood of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your name, Lord Jesus Christ. All glory is unto you, Daddy. Thank you because we love you. You first loved us, Lord, and we love you, Jesus Christ. We love you so much, there is nothing to compare with you in our lives. Thank you, Daddy. Blessed be your name, my King. Thank you, most high God. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And amen in Jesus' name. Glory be to God in Jesus' name. We are rounding up now. Our God is a great God. I want you to, to have, you to have it in mind. Every Sunday, we shall be doing the sprinkling of the blood of Jesus Christ. And as God is opening my eyes to verses in the Bible, so we will be using it and intensify on it. That the blood of Jesus Christ should begin to speak better things into our homes, into our lives. And that the blood of Jesus Christ should by himself use his blood as a demarcation between us and any form of evil in Jesus' name. That the blood of Jesus Christ should wash us clean from any form of stain in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And as we do, everyone will come down for our sake in Jesus' name. We are all protected by his blood in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen in Jesus' name. I do not want to say this, <laughs> but uh, I'm kind of shy, but I'm not shy at the same time. Actually, I do it by myself, but God, this is what you tell me to do. And as you are the one that give me this word by yourself, and I pray that you stand as my, <laughs> you stand as my witness in Jesus' name. Actually, I have purchased it, I have ordered it. I want to get platform and I want to get tripod. I want to get platform and I want to get a tripod. I've already ordered for the platform that I want, the altar that I will be using for my preaching. I've ordered it and the platform itself, I got one today at the store which I'm using now. It's a small one, but I want good one. And I don't want to include anybody. I'm not going to lie to you. God is my, but God says, I've already warned you, do not withhold the blessings of my children. Whatever you have to do, tell them. Whoever we, we join you, we join you. Whoever we not join. I'm not enforcing this on anyone. If you have, you will continue to have and you continue to be blessed in Jesus' name. Whatever God lays in your heart to give, give. If you don't, if you don't want to do, please, I've already, I'm looking towards it by myself. I'm doing what God says and instructed me to do. I don't want to tell anybody. I don't want to call anything for anyone to do. I'm not going to lie to you. But God says, do not withhold the blessings of my children. God says, I answered prayer through this ministry. You might not know. That's what God says to me. Do not withhold, do not withhold their blessing. Let them continue to receive this blessing. Say this as I want you to bring it to the platform. I'm not enforcing this. I repeat, God, you are my witness. I'm not enforcing this on anything. I'm only doing what God instructed me to do. Please, it's not a do or don't, or it's not a do or you don't do or whatever. I don't want to say anything negative. If God puts it in your heart, whatever God lays in your heart, give. If not, all is well. I've already ordered for the altar and you will see it soon. I'm telling you the truth. I've already placed order for it and you will see it soon. The tripod, because I want something good that we can use because I know this year something great is coming up this year for us in this ministry how God will bring it God has already told me about it but how he wants to do it I don't know so I want to prepare ahead of what God said is bringing this year so it's, I've already said this may God bless you may the, <laughs> may the blessings of God never depart from any of us in Jesus name May the Almighty God continue to enlarge our coast and expand our territory in Jesus' name. I personally am seeing the hand of God in every area of my life. Because as I said earlier on, I'm asking for something small and God is telling me, no, this is what I want for you. And this is how it's going to be. 
So God has been so faithful. And I thank God for everyone. I know the blessings of God will never depart from your home in Jesus' name. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. In Jesus' mighty name. I'm not forcing anyone to do this. But I have to say what God instructed me to do. God bless you all in Jesus' name. Let us begin to appreciate God tonight. Let us give him glory, give him honor. Exalt the name of the Almighty God. I want you to begin to thank God because God is good, God is great. God is awesome. God is wonderful. God is mighty. God is excellent. Begin to appreciate God. Begin to honor him. Begin to exalt his name. Lift him high tonight for the availability of his precious blood. Thank God for the sprinkling of his blood over your home. Thank Jesus Christ because by himself he has poured his blood over your home and all that belongs to you. Begin to appreciate God tonight. Begin to honor him. Daddy, tonight I thank you. I worship you. I honor you for who you have, for what you are doing. I thank you for your faithfulness, for your greatness, O Lord. In spite of whatever the devil might be thinking or doing, O Lord, thank you because you have always shown yourself great and mighty in our lives. Daddy, be that exalted and be that glorified. Lord, I worship you. Lord, I honor you. Lord, I exalt your name. I bow before your throne tonight to thank you. For destroy every satanic works over our lives by your blood, O Lord. For sending back every satanic arrow back, back to the sender by your blood. Thank you for delivering us by your blood, O Lord. Thank you because you have put a demarcation between us and every form of evil by your blood. Your blood has stand as our pillar. Lord, we thank you, Lord, we worship you. Because your blood is running over us day and night. Father, we appreciate you so much. Thank you for defending us by your blood. Thank you for protecting us by your blood. Thank you for delivering us by your blood. Thank you for the seven fashions, O Lord, that are in your blood that you have given unto us, O Lord. We have received them tonight, O Lord. We receive blessings. We receive glory. We receive honor. We receive strength. We receive power. We receive might. We receive grace. Us, O oh, Father, through your blood, Lord. We receive blessings, O Lord, by your blood. Daddy, we thank you. We thank you. Because you have strengthened us, O Lord. And you have strengthened our faith in you through your precious blood. Thank you, Father, for taking us to Gogota tonight and for raining your blood over us from the crown of our head to the sole of our feet. Daddy, be that exalted and be that glorified. Thank you, Lord Jesus. I worship you and I honor you. I exalt and I glorify your name. Thank you, my King. Thank you, my Lord. Thank you, Most High God. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen in Jesus' name. Glory be to God in the highest. God bless you all so much. I decree the blessings of God over everyone in Jesus' name. You are all blessed and highly favored. This is our year. Yes, the devil cannot snatch it from us. God has something special for each and every one of us this year. He said it in the beginning of the year that the days come when he will perform all his good works in our lives. The devil knows what God is having in store for most people this year. So he's trying to disrupt it. No. It cannot disrupt it. It cannot be done. Because he has lost the battle. The blood of Jesus Christ has availed for us. He has lost that battle. We are not going to miss out of what God has in store for us this year. He has something special, something marvelous. And he's going to bring it to come to pass in Jesus' name. Whether the devil likes it or not. What God has promised each and every one of us. It will come to pass this year. Just be prepared for it. Be strong and be of good courage. Be prepared for all the goodies that God has in store for you this year. Get yourself ready. Do not be afraid. Don't let your fail fail. Your, don't allow the devil to make your faith to fail. Your, you cannot fail. Your faith in the Lord cannot fail you. God will never fail you. And no demon can fail any of us. We are, we are strong in the Lord. We hold on to the pillar of the Almighty God. God is great. God is awesome. Always remember, He loves you before you first love Him. God bless you all. You are all wonderfully created by God. You are fearfully and wonderfully made by God. You are, you are one of a kind in the hands of God. There is no one like you. You are created wonderfully and fearfully created by God. So see yourself as the most precious child of God. And you are very dear to God. You are the apple of his eye. Nothing can snatch you away from his hand. 
I cover everyone with the blood of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus. Don't forget Psalm 24, 27, 91, 1, Psalm 136. Pray them into the water and come and draw the circle, draw the cross of the Lord Jesus Christ three times over the water and command that water to turn to the blood of Jesus Christ. You can do it tonight. If you want to do it tonight, do, I know for people in African and European country, you can do it now because it's midnight. And if you want to do it early in the morning, you can do it as well. God is great. I know that blood will work for us as we pour it over our lives, as we pour it over our home, over our body. It will work for us in Jesus' name. No demon will be able to dear God in our lives in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you all in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We have already put on the old armor of God, which is the blood of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Let's share the grace in fellowship. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit rest and abide with each and every one of us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the presence of the Almighty God forever and ever. Amen and amen and amen in Jesus' name. We are covered by the blood of Jesus. 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 We are covered by the precious blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you. Christ in us, hope of our glory. Christ in us, hope of our glory. Jesus Christ in us, the hope of our glory in Jesus' name. Amen. Seven hallelujah to the Almighty God. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Glory be to God in the highest in Jesus' name. God bless you all and you have a wonderful night. See you tomorrow, 5 a.m. By his grace. Stay blessed. I cover the night in the blood of Jesus Christ. As we lay in our bed tonight, I decree the presence of the Almighty God over us. I soak all our beds, our pillow, our children's beds, their pillow in the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus' name. I draw the circle of the blood of Jesus Christ around our homes, around our beds, around our children's bed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your name, O Lord. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you all. Enjoy the rest of your night. Stay blessed and see you tomorrow morning. Thank you all.